Barry, they say in comedy, when it comes to getting laughs, it's all about the timing. But in the new film, I now pronounce you Chuck and Larry, Adam Sandler and Kevin James also have plenty of comic chemistry. A chemistry that's not only evident on screen for these two, but as I found out, they have it off screen as well. Here's your backstage pass. I now pronounce you husband and husband. You may kiss the husband. Kiss the husband. Ooh. That's how we roll in our house, baby. Hell yeah. <laughs> In the new film, I now pronounce you Chuck and Larry, appearances can be deceiving. Adam Sandler and Kevin James play two best friends who are straight but pretend to be gay to get around some red tape at their firefighting job. If this marriage is something you've cooked up in response to this pension problem, you are not taking me down with you. This marriage is the only way I can make sure my kids get my pension if something happens to me. You guys take male bonding to a whole new level in this movie, so I gotta ask you, what sort of intimate things did you learn about each other playing these roles? Um, he uses secret under his arms. Secret, because it's made for a woman. And uh, I just tried to... But man, strong right? enough for a man. It is strong Absolutely. enough for a man. That's we didn't why. know that. We tested it. That, that's apparently strong enough for... Uh... A big man. A big man. <laughs> yeah. You know, get the king-size bottle for that. <laughs> yes, exactly. So, you know, I go through it. I, I put it on with a paint roller. How long is Uncle Chuck staying? What happened to your place? Are you and Dad homosexuals? But when city officials start to get suspicious of Adam and Kevin's relationship, the two friends hire a lawyer played by Jessica Biel. Your domestic partnership is being challenged by the city. You guys have nothing to worry about because you're a legitimate gay couple, right? Oh, yeah, we're, uh, no, we're big time fruits. Oh, I like men, the way they smell and... Okay. What was it like working with these two guys, yucking it up on the set? It was, um... It was just never-ending laughs, you know? These guys are naturally so witty and funny, and it's just who they are. It's their personality. They're not, they're not even, they're not trying, you know? And it's, it's, it's fascinating. Thanks to you, I can't get close to her. I can't even have freaking fun with her. Why can't you have fun with me? You're smothering me, man. I can't freaking breathe. Because you're afraid of feeling trapped. That's what happens when you get married. Fat ass, we're not really married. Now, you guys as a married couple, playing a married couple in this movie, you know. All right, looking at each other, what's the most attractive attribute would you see in each other? You got a good profile, buddy. Do I? Yeah. I can't go this way too much, because then chin fat comes out. <laughs> um, <laughs> Sandman's got abs. I didn't know that. I saw it every day in the trailer. Oh, that's yeah. right. I would shock him sometimes, because... Did uh, you know he was checking it out? Because uh, I threw it in his face. I yeah. said, look at this, buddy. He would say, look at this, buddy, and then he would crunch down uh, crazy. I kind of tense up my heart in the stomach. I had a... I can I can get an uh, abdomen definition for about five seconds, and then after five, I just turn away quick. Yeah. One thing Adam didn't turn away from quick was his co-star, Jessica Biel. In the film, Adam is a big-time womanizer. Meantime, Jessica's character thinks Adam is her best gay buddy. I'm cooking Alex a thank you dinner. You hitting on a lawyer again? Girl to girl, how do you turn Larry on? You can't touch her. Our lives depend on her continuing to think you're gay. Now, Adam, I gotta ask you, there's yeah. this scene where yeah. you and Jessica, she comes up to you and she asks you to see if some of her female attributes are real or not. Are you kidding me? There's no silicone here, I swear. Oh, no big deal if they are or not, I don't care. I've got nothing to hide, feel them. Feel them? Feel them. I, I, I mean, I, 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 I gotta ask you, how many takes did it take and were they all really necessary? That's a good question. She kind of, uh, I was good on take one. And then all of a sudden she was like, more, please more. And I was like, you know, uh, uh, you know we got a schedule, we're gonna meet, make our day. And she's like, five more, five more takes, Adam. It was cool because I knew it was nothing that we'd ever seen on film before. It was something that would be really funny if we did it right. And, um, we just laughed. We just laughed at the whole thing. They are going to quiz you about every aspect of your relationship. If we get caught, we're going to jail. Have a great day. Oh, we will. <laughs> every married couple has differences. So we've got Adam from New England, you from New York, Red Sox, Yankees. How are you working it Whoa. out? Whoa! I, I don't want to break anyone's heart, but Whoa. I am originally from New York, so I like the Yankees. 
A lot of Boston people can. And I am Mets, so this is oil and water right here, in a way. We watched a lot of baseball. He liked it. I saw the Mets almost win the World Series. That's right. That would have been how many for you guys? <laughs> three. Well, there's some Woo! serious pain with the Yankees going on this season. Yeah, Yankees. Yeah. Yeah. Right. How are we doing this year? Yeah, <laughs> I think you're way down there. Boston's uh, really loving it. Hey, look, the fact that Eucalyptus is a Jew makes all of us happy anyway. <laughs> <laughs> you are a lousy best friend and a stupid ugly husband. For the record, every time I laughed at one of your jokes, I was faking it. You're a monster. <laughs> Now, getting this comedy to the big screen wasn't as easy as you might think. The script for this movie was written and tweaked for over a decade in Hollywood. But the biggest hurdle was finding the right two comedians to make the odd friendship both funny and believable. Barry?